Hello everybody, welcome to Is This Good from MinMax. MinMax is a place about games, friends getting better. My name is Ben Hansen, joined of course by the Black Gate himself, Jeff Marchiafava. What? Terrible. Welcome. Uh, this show is brought to you by New Show Plus. If you are a $10 supporter on MinMax's Patreon, you not only help support independent games media, but you get to vote each and every week for which new show we create or continue. We will keep doing this show called Is This Good until the end of time, as long as you vote for it. So jump over there. Uh, 210's Vengeance lost with a furious passion. We were one vote away, Jeffum, from recording a full commentary track for the Prince of Persia movie from 2010. So oh, I know. don't let anybody tell you your vote doesn't matter, because literally one person chose that we're going to be streaming Batman Arkham Origins Blackgate instead of doing that commentary track. So thanks to the Backstage Pass supporters for letting this happen. Jeffum, how much do you know about Batman Arkham Origins Blackgate? I think you know that I literally knew nothing about it <laughs> when you brought it up as an option yesterday. I think it's the perfect week to talk about it because with uh, Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League, everyone's kind of, you know, itching for Arkham, right? At the same time, right. Prince of Persia made a 2D hey. Metroidvania and it freaking rules uh, with uh, Lost Crown. And so I think on the podcast last week on the MinMax show, we said, we talked about like, hey, remember that time that literally the director of Metroid Prime made a 2D Batman Arkham game that's a Metroidvania. And it came out in 2013 and people said, hey, yeah, yeah, moving on. So that's the point of this show is to go back and look and see, hang on, was this actually yeah. good? And you said that yesterday and I said, what? <laughs> what is this Metroid Prime designer right. Metroid Batman game that I've never heard of. Yeah, so Mark uh, Pacini, I forget, I think it's how you pronounce his last name, from Armature. Armature is the developer for this. They've just been purchased by Facebook not too long ago. Uh, but they... uh, I got ba I got bad news for you, Hanson. What's Interrupting it? news. Um, yeah. By a two-thirds vote, this was a bad intro. That for was a this bad show. intro. So, yeah. Um, I guess we stop now. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Just wait for this next section, though. Jeff, I'm going to be running Twitch okay. polls throughout the course of the stream to determine, is this good? Now, Jeff, I don't want to tell you how to do your job. I think it's more effective if we're, if we're having people vote, is this good, talking about Arkham Origins Blackgate rather than our conversation. I know, but we hadn't started yet. Right, I, right, I, I don't right, have right. anything to go off You were off stuck. Of you were stuck. You were stuck. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's jump into this sucker. No need for a movie gallery. Do you want a W bid? Yeah, let's let's whoop it. I assume that's a W B I D. All right, no Ugh. easy mode is an option, which is just the way I like the game, personally. Okay, Jeff, what about is this intro good? Mm. This already looks cool. This looks like the animated series. Too much rain. Gotham City is mine now. Three months Come ago, on. I took down the deadly. Kevin Conroy lives. But just because I'm here doesn't mean criminals will disappear. Now some of them see me as that a criminal. That is Kevin Conroy, right? <laughs> I'm going to have to stay a step ahead. Take to Who can tell? Now, nowadays with AI voices, you know. Sure. Hey, we know those legs. Batman. I'm sorry, Catwoman. That's Roger Craig Smith, is that right? Could someone confirm that? Did I just completely make an ass of myself? Oh, that sweet Kevin Conroy. Yeah, I guess it wasn't him. The baby being a secret government organization. You like Catwoman? Yeah. I, to be, but in case you didn't notice, I mean, I I, I was a kid when the over. when the first oh, Batman, uh, you know, Michael Keaton Batman too. came out sure. with the Tell BDSM Catwoman. So I think that completely guard. warped my brain, and I can't not you think sure of that whenever I hear Catwoman. Yeah. And every time you see a cat, you get the urge to wear you leather and whip yourself. I go, meow. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this game came out in 2013 on the 3DS and PlayStation Vita. That's cool. I love that. I love the shaky gun right next to him. Hey, Hanson. Yeah. People love this intro. It does like two thirds again. Wow. All right. Even as we're talking over it rudely. I have a feeling Batman's going to leave that rooftop. He wouldn't. Oh, I guess not. I guess this is the part where Batman just stays on the roof for the rest of the game. Okay, how? So I've played like five minutes of this game before, according to Steam. 
Uh, so it was originally 2013 released just for handheld, and then they ported it. So it is available on Steam. Um, yes, it does look a little floaty to me as well. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, they have music. I love this song. This is just from Arkham City. Now you're telling me I should counter. This is interesting, converting this combat to 2D. Why does it look like it's going at like 70% speed, Super doesn't slow. it? Maybe it's maybe it's just the tutorial. No. Not even sweating. She's right, looking like she's walking in slow motion Yeah, because you're, you're like doing Tai Chi, you're not girl, fighting. You? Okay. I've got a feeling helpless is one thing you aren't. Handsome, strong, and in touch with his Thank you, Cookie, even for the big sub. Dream. What a dream boat. How's the game volume, everybody? Should we should we up it a little bit? She's crawling around like a cat. That is true. Okay, so we can throw a little cute batarang. Let me. Can I aim that? No. Huh. Um. All right. Hey, Twitch, is this good? Is this gameplay that you've seen so far good? And I wish you could feel it, because it's not not feeling great, I gotta say. But you tell me. Alright, run and glide. Okay. <laughs> Little floaty still. So I I played like five minutes of this game years and years ago, and my takeaway was I wish it was more 2D than it is. It's trying to do like a little bit mm -hmm. of two and a half D style stuff. Um, which I don't think you need. I think people, if they announced a new Arkham 2D Metroidvania now, people would go gaga, right? It'd be the second coming of Christ. Gamers would rejoice. <laughs> so I feel like you don't need to up it with the production values of trying to go two and a half D. Like we don't need to, we don't need this oh, type, yeah, type of stuff, you know? It's just, you know, unnecessary, I say. All right, let's keep running. What is this? I guess this is a Dutch angle in reference to Batman 66, I'd have to imagine. All right, do we have to do the pry, the classic Batman pry? No one pries like Batman, hell yeah. This is Arkham, baby. Here we go. Oh boy. And then you crouch and then enter. This camera, hang on, weird. And now we're in first person. Yeah, so it's a little Metal Gear Solid uh, angle here, okay. Yep, this is it. Interesting reusing the music. I mean, Arkham City's music is so damn good that I don't mind, but it is odd. Now, Jeff, uh, where are we at? 65% of people with the with the generic, is the gameplay good? 65% said eh. 35% said kinda? <laughs> and those were the only options, which Ray Luaza says I need to give better options. So. Yeah, that is true. Okay, so you need to track this throughout the course of the course of the stream here to see how people's opinions on this game are changing. Yeah. Right, here we go. See, again, we're thrilled about the 2D-ness, and you gotta wonder, like, is it a matter of Armature wanting to push how quote-unquote 2D this game is, or do you think it's Warner Brothers being like, we can't actually make a 2D Batman game? I mean, I know that's what hardcore gamers want, but this needs to look good in a commercial running at GameStop for people who are trying to buy a new game for their PlayStation Vita. Okay, here we go. Okay. Now, perfect. Now, Blackgate. That's like Arkham, but for wimps? That's for like the humans? Is that right? Yeah. Just like if you're just a bad, like Falcone would go to Blackgate, but super villains would go to Arkham? And yeah, Arkham's kind of like the who's who of Villains, right? Is Arkham an insane well, asylum or a prison? No or a little bit of both? Games. Just give uh, me what you, you stole know. and we can stop this now. Aren't all super villains technically insane? Maybe some are more sane than us, Jeff. Finders keepers. And when I play, I play for keeps. Is now that I'm thinking about it, yeah. Is classifying all the super villains as insane just an end run around so that you don't have to like have like limits to how how long you're putting them in jail you can just say like oh well you're crazy and once you stop being crazy i.e once right. you stop being a super villain then we'll let you out mm. but technically we know that's never going to happen so we're basically just putting you away without the chance of parole well, or I, I feel like most like most batman stories are like uh oh penguins up for parole again i think 
Actually, I read a survey once. It was 78% of Batman stories start with that. Okay, how's the poll looking, Jeff? You just, you just missed the map. <laughs> um, Stay sharp. Polls ended. I asked. <clears throat> Should it all be 2D? Um, and let's view the results, my friend. Go for this guy. 60% said a little 3D seems cool. Wow, a majority. I, that's interesting. 30% 30, 30 said two dimensions only, and 10% said no, try something new, which I take as all, you know, do as much 3D stuff as you want. So it seems like a little bit people are okay with. Um, I'm surprised. I thought everyone would be like, make it pixelated. The, the closer a Metroidvania can look to Super Metroid, the more we'll like it. I assumed it was gonna be the takeaway. So, you know what? Maybe I stand corrected. Maybe Warner Brothers has done the test. They've done their own polls on Twitch, presumably. I don't know if I can make this gameplay faster. Let's see. God, this music's so good, I don't really mind. Going in slow motion. I mean... Advanced? That's gonna break. All right. I mean, I think my computer can handle this. So who knows what it is. It doesn't look that slow motion. It does, but doesn't it look like it's going like 80% speed or something during combat? Maybe that's just yeah. the game they made. Technical well, limitations. We'll we'll do a poll and see what people think. <laughs> see, this, this stuff I'm on board for. I don't mind the fighting in 2D. I think that works pretty well, I think. Wow, that looked exhausting. Feel free to take a break if you need one. It is weird that Spider-Man is Black Cat and Batman is Catwoman, but I guess that's kind of the classic comics thing of like they both have a Shazam or Captain Marvel and all that stuff, right? Everyone's just DC yeah. and Marvel are just kind of, we'll just rip each other off and it's fine. And everybody, if you're into comics, you understand. You understand we had no choice but to copy what the other people were doing, our distinguished competition. People keep saying that the slow motion is the last hit and that happens in no. other Arkham games. But I it know. Seems, it, fe it feels like this is every single hit is yeah. slow motion. I know what you're saying. I don't think it's that. I think it's also just like the running. I just feel like it's a little yeah, you, slow. Yeah, you look super slow. Uh, but it doesn't look choppy to me, so it's an interesting fusion. All right, this is cool. Yeah. Now, latest ooh, latest yeah. poll is in. What is Catwoman doing? Can she just walk <laughs> down that normal? Oh, you take back uh, Is the combat right, too slow? 64% yes, said like yes. We think she's 36% like said yes, exclamation up. point. No. So. Okay. Hey, uh, could you do a poll, Jeff? Um, These men are heavily oh. armed. Wanted to make sure I'm not seen. Had people heard of this game before the look? Has anybody, what percentage of you have seen this game in action? Is probably a better way to put it. This whole city's gone right. weird okay. on me. Do you ever feel like a whole city has gone weird on you? Okay. Not many options here. I just, maybe once we get inside the prison, it'll be a little bit more 2D-ish. This is interesting, just like, hit Y to switch the target. All right, uh, let's go for this. Oh no, right in his line of sight. Go. So can I just glide kick him? How dare they live? Yeah, <clears throat> it's, it's interesting that they try to recreate the Arkham games so much when it feels like 2D Metroid Batman. Just right. Those just words. make the best That's version right. of that. You hired the guy to do it. Yes. Yeah. Just do yeah. that. We think she and I interviewed the games director, Mike Ruscini, back when I was at Game Informer on the Game Informer show. These and I was just trying to look at that interview again. I think his big takeaway was like, it was a tough project because it was just a lot of, a lot of hands in that pie. Got like coordinating mm. everything in this studio, alone. and then also you want to get Rocksteady's approval, also Warner Brothers corporate. It just felt like it was kind of a a mess on a that nightmare. front, but I should go back and watch that full interview again to try and... It's like he stumbled into Arkham Asylum. All the supervillains were telling him how to make his game. The lawyers are the ultimate supervillains. That's right. Like Haley McClane. Uh, e. Clark subscribed, and he said, I bought this on 3DS right after the deepest dive on Asylum. Oh, really? And did you beat it? What is that thing? What is that thing? Is it some sort of bat, man? All right, see, this is where I feel... Oh boy. 
Oh boy, let's try and have a strategy this time. I can't button mash my way through. 63% of people said they have not seen this in action. Right. That is yeah. wild, isn't yes, it? Like meow. This is an Arkham should... game, everybody. I would say it's wild if I wasn't also one of them. Um, <laughs> Maybe you're the wildest of all. Wanting to make sure I'm not seen. Okay, so the catch is not to be seen. So don't jump down, perhaps. Got him. The filthiest little okay. town I ever loved. Oh, I wonder if, like, on 3DS, I wonder if you're, like, touching the screen on Vita or, like, 3DS, you're kind of moving this around like this. Let's try and figure out what are the 3DS and Vita mechanics that they retrofitted into work for the other versions here. Okay, so Jeff, um, don't get seen, no matter what. This guy's right? Gosh, I want to take these guys down, Jeff. Um. So they say don't get seen, but but what if we were seen? Yeah, you can't you can't string that guy up if you're over there. See, I can't. Not having like free control, it's weird. I can throw a battering at them. Give me five minutes with any of these freaks, and I'll have them begging for their mothers. Yeah. Do you really believe that, sir? All right, so. Let's go ahead and take this guy out. Something out there. That's a Batman. <laughs> it's a Batman. Now shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Is that working? Jesus Christ, Batman. I think the reason no one played this game is because the first scenario was impossible to get through. Impossible. Yeah. This is shocking. Well, at least we know that you got to this section in five minutes the first time that you played. Yeah. I wonder That's if I right, did. Sir, dressed as a cat. Yes, like meow. We think Little quick ledge takedown. I'd love to do a ledge takedown from anywhere else here. These men are heavily armed. I need to make sure I'm not. There's seen. a takedown prompt after you glide kicked him. Is that right? Well, let's figure it out. Take one payment I off don't the books, really know how effective that detective mode would be here. Okay. Let's go ahead and glide kick this fool around this corner so no one can see him. Hey, look a yeah, this was this is the worst idea ever. On me. All right, now do the do the takedown. <laughs> Jeff, um, <laughs> Jeff, um, Hang on. There's, do you have a pole Honest going? Is Hanson bad at stuff? That's not even stealth. That's, that's just right, sir. Dressed as a cat. basic competency. Yes, like meow. You think she's working they did ultimately take down the Batman. Can you do a takedown from the person it, itself? I'd love to. These men are heavily armed. I need to make sure I'm not seen. I, I guess I set you up on this on this poll because right now 95% are saying, yes, you're obviously bad. I honestly don't think so. I think this looks terrible. No, um, I think I think I'm bad. All right, so let's let's switch target. Let's take this guy out and then let's follow that takedown prompt once he's around the corner. Man, so right foot patrols are killing me. There we go. Okay. Just a quick head punch, bat fly of his skull the way it should be. He's with God now. So let's just wait until this other guy's around the corner. We're learning. We're learning here. Yeah, it's not really stealth, but I guess all stealth is just kind of patiently waiting, so. Maybe it is the greatest stealth game ever made. All right, here we go. Could be. And then, that is such an odd system. Like These animations. I can't run around freely. That's the weird part. Like. You just have to, mm. it feels like a phone game or something, you know? Sorry, buddy. Well, there you go. You did it, though. I suppose so. The 96% of people who said that you're obviously bad at stealth games are going to have to rethink uh, their opinion. Their lives. Hey, their political thoughts. Um, change everything about yourself if you're in that 96% of that group. Right. Okay. Come here for the cinema. Now, might you have Blackgate in your Blackgate game? Because I do feel like once we get in there, baby, once we start navigating that. I see him. On me. And you're telling me you didn't review this game back at Game Informer, Jeff? Because this feels like exactly the type uh, of game that you would have reviewed. Apparently, Reiner did. Someone in the comments said Reiner gave it a six. 
Six? Yep. If you showed Reiner a drawing of Batman on a piece of paper drawn with crayons, he'd give that as 7.5. So that is... That is true. That is stunning. Um, do these guys want me to... Do, all right. I guess this is what it wants me to do. If they don't have a gun, I guess it's game on. Yep. Okay, I'd like to take down just a little bit. Okay, and then you, and then... Why was that in slow motion? It is always satisfying. It's so good in these games when that it last is. kill happens yeah. and it goes into slow-mo. But excellent. part of the reason it works is because every other hit is just lightning fast. Mm. And right. here, it all still feels very sluggish. Did you see that? That was pretty cool. Yeah, sure. If you want to just press A to make that guy fall. I mean, Quick I didn't time. dislike it. Here's here's the question for your poll, Jeff. Um, <laughs> well, physics. first of all, uh, the last poll was, do you feel bad about saying Hanson is bad at stealth? Right. Uh, one person voted, yes, sorry, Hanson. <laughs> the other 10 said, sorry, not sorry. Yeah, that's the way it goes. It's a harsh, it's a harsh chat today. Yeah. What do we do to fix that? We just have to be so freaking nice that they could not possibly vote against us in a poll. Yeah. We I gotta, yeah. We gotta make them feel bad. Okay. What well, what were you saying? What's the next poll that you wanted to know? Hey, this is that's some cool little you action. My question is. That's what you'll learn about me. I never stop. Hang on, Jeff. And they're having a little dull okay. entendre. Okay. What they're paying me to let this all go. Is that what women are looking for in a sexual partner? Is somebody who won't stop? Is that the double entendre that he's going for? There's a reason Batman lives alone in a cave, Hanson. Or what if it, it's Catwoman making the sexual reference, and then Batman is just, he's asexual. Oh, he's, he, he doesn't even yeah, comprehend that she's way, like. It's right over his head. Right. He's like, no, I can Strong. fight criminals the entire <laughs> night. Come on. But what about in bed? I've never fought a criminal in bed, but I'm sure I could, and I'd go right all night. I'm keeping my eyes in front of me. If you zipped up and hid your cleavage, you'd be more effective in combat. This is where I get off. Feels like every Catwoman appearance, she has that line. This is my stuff. Yeah. I just don't like how confident Catwoman is. I guess is what I'm trying to say. I want a self-doubting wow. Catwoman. Bye bye. Is it too much to ask for? Oh, my question was the hot, hot question. Is um, will this game have a higher Metacritic than? Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League. Oh. Uh, Let's find this question. game's highest Metacritic, whatever platform. I think there's a chance that All right. the press so is so sour. Upload this again? This ends here. Come on, what Cat kind of Woman. Do you think I am? Because chances are, you're right. She just loves Batman. Okay, sure. Do you remember, I love Arkham City, but do you remember, first of all, if I dressed as a cat, <laughs> I would get so tired of people telling me about cats, talking to me about cats, referring to me as a cat. They did that 70% of her dialogue is referencing the fact that she's dressed like a cat. She should be locked up in Arkham for that alone. Um, Absolutely. But do you remember how weird it is in Arkham City where, okay, all right, Catwoman, I'm hip. Jesus Christ, Catwoman. I'm trying to throw a batarang at you like a gentleman. Um, well, apparently, Freezenification says uh, Blackgate has a 68 on, for 3DS. So That's the highest? I think so. I think there's a chance. There's a chance that'll be higher than where Suicide does Squad it, is. Does it have to be higher than than every version of Suicide Squad? Mm, maybe. Maybe. Okay. Um, oh, anyways, in Arkham City, I remember in 2011, happening? it was the <laughs> I'm, I'm holding her off so I can have, make my point about Arkham City. Oh, okay. In 2011, there was definitely discussion about this, but I feel like now it'd be like, wait, what? Like, remember how many people call Catwoman a bitch? Mm -hmm. And like, when you play her, play as her in those playable sequences, like every enemy is like, I gotta stop this bitch, this stupid, like everybody, like 
every line of dialogue from my memory is just people calling her a bitch. It's like, this is, this is odd. And yeah, and people pointed that out and then, you know, there was the backlash of like, well, they're criminals and they would talk that way. Right. And then other people pointed out like, you know, like the entire Dark Knight trilogy, no one ever called anyone a bitch and none of the, you know, previous, like, writers can actually write anything they want for characters. Right. Um, but th that it will just feel normal if you don't do it. Those are resi residents of Gotham City. This was Arkham City. Uh, they're a little bit right. more foul mouth. Uh, what's the poll saying for that prediction? Uh, no chance right. uh, got, so how do I upload got two thirds of the vote. So the Suicide Squad will have a higher what kind review. Of girl do you think I am? That's what that's what people are guessing. Are. Okay. You're right. Okay. Now here wow, we go. Wow, she is just. This is this is one thirsty cat woman. Uh, <laughs> this kitty needs some milk, but. I, That's gonna be the next line. You realize? I know. Okay. Now I'm just gonna keep countering everything because I don't think that it actually wants me to fight. It just wants me to. <laughs> Make it a quick tap event based on counters is what I'm learning here. Every line of dialogue from Catwoman could just be summed up with the tone. Oh, you know. You tell me what was in the files, and I'll see about getting you sent somewhere less dangerous than Blackgate. I like a little danger. Jesus. Besides, what's in those files isn't my business. Thank you, John Scott, for the big sub. The Avengers game has a 67 on Metacritic. That is a great reference point. I think this might be close, you guys. Yeah. I think the press is so sour on Suicide Squad. I mean, there's no doubt that'll be a much better game than this, but... Okay, she's just, like, stroking the edge of her Wait, shirt. We don't... Yeah, let's... <laughs> <sighs> the thing about Catwoman, Jeff, I don't Video know if you games. got it. Here's the thing. She's part cat, part horn dog. 50-50 split. <laughs> That's all you need to know, I guess, about her cats as a character. Horn dogs. This it's is raining this is what, cats and horn dogs. Sure That's we'll right. Something. Maybe if you gave us your cell number. What do we know? There was an explosion at Blackgate about six hours ago. They think maybe an escape attempt went bad. And the inmates took advantage and overran the guards. Afraid so. They're in a right, here we go. Blackgate time. Outside the prison gates. Hostages. The entire prison staff. Blackgate. Seems like we were just there. You don't have to tell me. I'll approach the prison from the riverside. <laughs> that side's I'll use my hand like this. A sheer wall down to the water. Yeah, the like Batman. the, the first intro, in those animated, you know, uh, like storyboards yeah. looked really good, and now it's just kind of like whatever we can do, you know, to get their <laughs> shot. <laughs> Let's see, what parts can we animate? His nose will kind of sniffle in the rain. I, st I still think these are kind of cool. I don't mind them. If you put this music... Oh! Was he holding his breath? <laughs> I don't know. Land of the Dead? All right. Oh, there you go. There. <sighs> that's pretty sweet. I always love how that's that's a thing in so much fiction where it's like, oh, somehow like they just figured out how to make a tiny portable <laughs> like breather that, yeah. that would You can just say be Phantom so Menace. Helpful. The Tomb Raider yeah. has it too, doesn't it? How about giving a girl a, a ton of a ton of I'm that shows up in a lot of different movies. And you're telling me that's not a thing. I don't think so, buddy. Apparently not. She's mine. Well, why would anyone need little old me? Doesn't matter to me, lady. I just got orders, and that's that. Here we go. Now, one, two, or three. What do you like? Um, three. Okay. I don't like his pants. I don't like your pants! We got him. All right, take him down. Take him down oh, to Arkham it. City. Where the cats are women and jokers are. Jeff, um... <laughs> Take it away. Or don't. Jeff, um's great at karaoke. That's a, that's if, any, if anybody wants to. Do, okay, that's what I, it's a Twitch fault situation, I understand. How did you get so popular? Besides the obvious. 
Uh, oh, he was acknowledging that she was hot. And find a way out of here. Like you said, Blackgate's too intense for a sweet little thief like me. Ooh, but then they jumped good. me, each trying to keep me from joining the other side. What do you mean, side? The heavy hitters hate each other. Where the cats are women and the jokers are sickly? I <laughs> guess that's by my I think that's a the winner. The way I hear it, Penguin has the cell blocks and controls movement around Blackgate. He locked all the staff in a cell on Blackgate's lowest level, the Arkham Way. Black Mask's taking charge of the prison's industrial complex. He decides right, Black Mask is the big and bad. And the Joker's but he was in Origins as well as the big bad, right? The computers that encrypt the codes for the locks or I guess what, Joker cells. was the ultimate big he bad in Origins bad again, which is that twist, to right? Get to the hostages, someone has to go to the industrial was Black Mask. Yeah, I think, and I think Joker, Joker was in one of the previous Get through games. the cell blocks to get down there. Well, I got and that part. I'm <laughs> No, but hostages. Origins. It was weird because it's like, ah, this is before he knows the Joker. And then the twist was... So let's Black Mask was the Joker? Is that I right? I feel like I feel like I every Batman villain is in every game. And feed you information <laughs> it's, as you it's just how person. big is their part? Which You're is funny that even... Punch everybody. Why should I trust you gotta punch anyone? everybody. At yeah. Even in Suicide Squad, I don't know if you saw that, want? but they you started teasing, like, by the way, you can help there's also some post-game content coming, and it's like a Joker-themed... You like uh, take over of some building or Blackgate, maybe I forget. See those innocent people down there hurt. Um, I'm just and so that's the confusing thing of like, wait, is the Joker like alive then, or is this gonna be some Joker wannabes, which is probably what it's gonna be? Hey, Hanson, yeah. you're winning over chat. Wait, uh, no tricks. Fifty-eight percent thought your no version of that song was be better be than the original. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Hello, recording artist. I got Move something over. for you. Oh, I like. I like the word V, because I like the show, but I do like that it just looks like a comic book. See, these, these are all right. This is cool. I uh, I watched The Flash recently on a plane. Have you seen that film? Uh, no. I saw I saw a breakdown of some of the more uh, the worse um, special effects in it. Yeah, was it the Corridor Crew? Yeah. Yes. Okay, I love those yep. guys. Um, yeah, like the opening with the babies falling out of the building and stuff. Uh, gotta say, I liked I liked the Flash a lot more than I thought I would. I was going in very skeptical, but and it, it, beyond just you know I like. Hang on, that's kind of cool. I get to choose where to go. All right, let's travel to the administration, please. Sounds fun. Uh, more than just the Michael Keaton Batman nostalgia, which of course I'm going to be on board for that stuff. And it was fun to see Michael Keaton back, but I think the movie itself was was fun. Um, the Flash almost made me cry, Susie Munchen. There we go. Uh, wow. The, but what got me so nostalgic in that movie was, and the reason I liked it ultimately was like, this, it was fun to have the Batwing come back. Like you forget how nostalgic you are for like vehicles from your youth. It's like, man, I love 1989 Batman so much. Just seeing the Batwing like descend from his cave was so cool. And they do like, they make an homage to the greatest shot in cinema history. And where the Batwing goes over the moon. And then before it dives down into the parade to attack Joker, do you remember this? So everything that you liked about the Flash was Batman references. <laughs> but it, but I think it's a solid movie outside of the Batman okay. nostalgia. I swear. But I mean, yeah, the Kat best parts were <laughs> Michael Keaton uh, putting on the bat suit and kicking butt. Kath is lurking, follows that up, saying, "Isn't the actor in jail now?" Oh yeah, very much so. Yeah. Uh, Actually, I don't even know that, but there were some legal difficulties to the point that they didn't do any press for the movie, I think. Well, well they sent him to Blackgate. Oh, uh, is that right? Um, we'll find yeah. we'll find them. We'll, we'll recover him. Okay. <laughs> did you, did you, the wait, walking did you animation? See that nurse walking? Yeah. yeah. It's interesting you get to choose where you want to go. You to be notified when the yeah, that's not how these games work. That's not how these games work at all. been some unexpected developments. It's weird to think this is canonical with Suicide Squad. You need to pull the plug. I make the decisions. Isn't that a weird idea? And I say we keep going. There's something to be gained here. It is. It has to be, yeah. Uh, judging from your face, I don't know if you think that that's the most boring idea ever. Or... I I don't even I don't even know how to process that. Honestly. Yeah. Do you know how to process process this graffiti? Do you ever put this graffiti up on your bedroom door when your kid wakes up? Yes. Okay. Um. When I try and sleep longer in the mornings, I scrawl that. He can't read yet, but right. one of these days it's going to pay off. Why does it have to be in blood every time? 
Okay, here we go. Now, this is gameplay. Locate the correct code. All right. Oh, oh, oh. oh what is this? Trigonometry? Oh. Okay, so is it three? No. So it needs to be, oh, it's like, oh, it's like Wait your precious Wordle. Oh, here it is. All right. Wait a minute, do I love this? <laughs> It's not bad for a little puzzler. That's uh, it's not a bad way to go. Beep, beep, beep. Hack, hack, hack. Can we ask, was that hacking minigame good? Already on it. Okay, good. This is why you get the big bucks. Are you going to let me Metroidvania around at a certain point here? Jesus Christ! The Joker's at it again, Jeffum. No, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, can I... What? I can't throw my batarang at the teeth? This isn't Arkham. So I just have to walk into them and blow them up? That cannot <laughs> be right. Yeah, that doesn't, doesn't seem right. What? Absolutely not. All right, sure. Even Prince of Persia. Like, I like the game from what I played so far of it. But in the beginning, I, I had that same feeling of like, just let me get to the Metroidvania stuff. Like, I, you don't need to set up the story stuff. We don't want cutscenes. Just get me running around looking at a map. Count down to look at a map in a Metroidvania is a very important thing. I haven't quite finished. I'm sure you'll see more Troy Baker, ladies and gentlemen. Improvements as you go along. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere, Joker. Am I Neither are Black you. Gate? You'll give me the codes for the crypto Keep sequence broken. or we'll end this here. He broke it. No, I don't think so. I don't know. I'm going to the warden's office to finish my alterations while you go find the warden. So can you I look up Jeffum? Is this that's how gracious a host I am? So this was 89% of people room. thought that Please. hacking minigame was good. Here we go. So this must be a sequel chronologically so to I'd Origins say. then, if Joker's in it. Right? That would make sense. Here's another critique of Batman villain performances. I know whoever plays the Joker, they have a lot to chew on. They're it always is. celebrated. Oh, yeah? Yeah. It is a sequel? It is a sequel. Okay. It's a companion game and sequel to Arkham Origins. Gotcha. Anyways, I feel like, not to diminish anybody who's ever played Joker, I feel like actors love to ham it up. It's not a stretch that, hey, here's the ultimate ham it up role, and they make it interesting, you know? I don't know if we should be celebrating that in such a big way. I'm not big on play. And just to avoid any <laughs> criticism, I'm of course talking about Jack Nicholson and not Heath Ledger. Rest in peace, Heath Ledger. Right. But Jack right. Nicholson, let's just go. take back a little bit of that praise because <laughs> that is the hammiest performance of all time. I love it, but it's just, yeah. it's like, hey, action, I mean, be obnoxious. It's like every actor can do that, you know? I guess, I feel like, Would have been nice I feel like that, that era, the Joker was goofier still. Mm. And so he was just kind of he was having fun with it. I, the the one that annoys me is the the stories about Jared Leto like yeah. sending dead rats to his you know like <laughs> co-workers and stuff to get into the role or whatever. It's like right. come on dude, you we, no nobody wants that. Absolutely. Nobody wants to Spe work with The that. only thing I want Mobius. less <laughs> Mobius. The only thing I want less is being in any movie or having any contact with Jared Leto? No, no, no. The one thing I want less than getting mailed the dead rat from Jared Leto is this map in a Metroidvania. What is this? Oh, this is very portally, isn't it? It's it's almost like a non-rotatable version of the Metroid Prime map, but it's like they made a 2D version of the isometric. Oh. What was that mess up there? What do you mean? This is a very clear map. This is where I need to go. This is... Fatal flaw for this is, quote yeah, unquote this 2D. Is, this Metroidvania. is why you don't you don't try and add the third dimension in your 2D Metroids. No, don't do it. Don't do it at all. Pop quiz, Jeff. Um, pop quiz, bats. That's my Joker. I get nominated for an Oscar if I did it. I think. Um, yeah. Does Heath Ledger say anything funny? Does he make a joke in Dark Knight? Him trying to blow up the hospital, I would argue, is a funny scene. Can't get across that gap. Where he's like pressing the thing over and over again, but Wayne I don't know if that's a joke. What joke does he have? Building. 
Maybe there's one of our cable oh, launchers man. lying around I feel somewhere. like the magic trick. Oh, magic trick. Interesting. With the pencil yeah. and the eye. I mean, not haha -ha funny. It's technically, <laughs> <laughs> it's technically, I guess, a comedic rhythm. I, yeah, I, I feel like, I feel like he had some kind of, you know, like, wry moment talking about Batman. Like, like the, <laughs> the, the equivalent, the equivalent of, you know, uh, where does he get those wonderful toys kind of like. I don't um, think, I think that is five times funnier than anything the Joker says in Dark Knight. Yeah, it's it's a different it's a different, you know, it's kind of like it's kind of like the straight man in a in a comedy compared to Batman. He's the he's the goofball. Yeah. OK, the big the big goofy guy. I understand his name is Joker. His name isn't Reister for a reason. He you know, he paints he paints all those uh the funny the funny things on all the walls where he changes you know like slaughter is the best medicine instead of laughter is oh, the best medicine oh yeah yeah, yeah. Does, Come he do on. That? does he do that in dark knight he's he's a good yeah he's a good he's a good wordsmith okay that's not bad uh, the beginning heist was funny with all the betrayals yeah he does jokes but so clearly a psychopath is always more scary than funny i was thinking about this recently i was thinking about the joker as i'm prone to do um oh that's interesting Oh, weird. Okay. Purely so. paint-based humor, H. Dunn <laughs> says. But, uh, oh, there is something to do up here. Uh, is the Joker the most, um, I want to say iconic, I don't know, what's the best word? I'm trying to think of, like, the most famous fictional characters of all time. It's like, okay, Mickey Mouse, I guess, but, like, with a personality. Most famous fictional character of all time with a personality is the Joker number one. That <laughs> question <laughs> makes no sense. How I are mean, we defining personality? Like north of yours. Wow. Like, no, Mickey Mouse is below Still you. Still no. You're, okay. <clears throat> okay, who? There's, um... Astro Boy? Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Astro Boy is more famous than the Joker. SpongeBob? Oh, that's interesting. Is SpongeBob? No. I think the Joker's more famous than SpongeBob. Bugs Bunny. Bugs Bunny. I think Joker's more famous than Bugs Bunny. Look, I'm not proud of it. I'm not happy with it. No, this is like that, that Sonic conversation we had. <laughs> In 2019. What was it? What was it? The Sonic, Sonic versus the Flash? Yeah, Kyle argued more people knew who the Flash was than Sonic the Hedgehog, and I would merely point you to the box office results of those films <laughs> as well, some, some indicator. Uh, all right, so we need to find some electronic lock. To, Charlie uh, Brown, String Bacon points out. More famous than the Joker? Get the hell out of here. Yes. Batman more famous than the Joker? Perhaps, but Batman's a bit of a flat lad. James Bond. James Bond. Now, now they got now you. Now we're cooking. Spider-Man, Garfield. I, I think you... you Mother effing Garfield, son. Okay. <laughs> you got to stop saying that. Okay, <laughs> if you randomly jumped around Earth to 500 random people, like teleport, 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 showed them a picture of the Joker and showed them a picture of James Bond, more people know the Joker is my point. Because a picture of James Bond is very generic and there's yep. been 10 James Bonds. But if you said There's been James 10 Jokers. Bond, there's been 10 Jokers. If you said if you said James Bond, yeah, but all the all the Jokers all jokers look alike. Oh, here we go. I disagree. Jokers have more variety in their looks than James Bond. It's just a guy with a gun wearing a suit. Joker, you got different tattoos. <laughs> All that good stuff. How am I supposed to destroy this, Jeff? Um, it looks I like it can be destroyed. Paying attention to this game. <laughs> well, for the last that's 20 to minutes. the viewer's detriment, buddy. All right, let's just go through here. We're, oh, we're... well, poll results aren't looking good for you, Hanson. So who? Randomly teleporting to 500 different people on Earth. You think SpongeBob's getting more? I don't think so. Yeah. SpongeBob more than the Joker. I think you're out of your mind. I think you should be locked up in Blackgate. No. Freaking Arkham, actually. It's that serious of a, a Oh, my God. Pikachu. Pikachu. Homer Simpson, Kath is, Kath is, Kath's got the list. 
Mario Barbie. Barbie only made a billion dollars. Yeah, the Joker's made a billion dollars like four times. Actually, no, I know. I know it's outgrossed every Batman movie, but okay. <laughs> Can no we... way. A hundred percent of votes. Twenty people. <laughs> <laughs> Sherlock Holmes surely freezing the freezing the Sherlock Holmes. Says. No. In the year twenty twenty four. You don't think Sherlock Holmes? If you if you went up to someone and said, "Who's Sherlock Holmes?" No. Teleporting around the world, showing a wanted poster. Yes. That is my criteria. Absolutely, oh, the Joker that's crushes Sherlock. Such. That's such a. That's such a zoomed in like constructed artificially constructed <laughs> way and nine out of ten people would just say yeah it's a clown sure and they'd say no it's they'd the say clown before joker my friend they would say jester they would say jester what country yeah you're, you're not you're not factoring in all the joke all all of the uh jester and clown votes that are going to get siphoned out of joker because they yeah. look at a picture a wanted picture is this a black and white picture? Can we focus? It is, it is of course. <laughs> it's a black and white picture, and I'm holding it from. Is uh, that the clown from away. it? String bacon says, "Yeah, that's what that's what people are gonna think." More people know Pennywise than Joker. That's foolish. Um, here's my question though. Not um, more. Darth Vader, an actual sad taco says Darth Vader. Joker. Joker is absolutely more recognizable than Darth Vader. Absolutely. No. Absolutely. No. It's a no, it's a guy in face paint, and like you said, there's been ten versions of him. Versus Darth Vader? You're teleporting around the world with a picture of Vader on a wanted poster. I think I think Hell Joker's yeah. taking it. You show it, no matter what language they speak, they're gonna go. <laughs> That's them just trying to scare you away because they don't want to talk to you anymore. Maybe. Um so can we focus on this freaking game? Hitmonchan says Joker more than Darth Vader is as absurd as Flash over Sonic. There you go. <laughs> really? Okay, the point is, what <laughs> what is the game plan here? Uh, okay, okay, let's go to overview. Can I teleport to a different place? I guess not. Joker is not captured here. No matter what they say. Huh. Uh, so, Jeff, here's what we got. A grapnel gun. I mean, it says I need the little line thing to get through that part. I mean... B uh, 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 so, we have fragile stuff up here. Jeff, um... Hey, head in the game. Head in the game. Wait, are you frozen? <laughs> Is the entire computer frozen? Am I recording anymore? Well, no wonder their heads weren't in the game. I think the internet's gone down. Well, now that I'm by myself, I guess I'll continue talking to myself. That's interesting. That's the worst control scheme I've ever seen in my life. Bad timing. You just happened to show up on the day the prison decided to spray for bats. Look. Troy Baker seems like a nice guy, but we could all do that. It's Joker gas! It's Joker gas! Ding, 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 ding! Let me out, Joker. I don't like the gas at all. It'd be diabolical if we could just open it. <laughs> Step one, just open the door he closed. Step two, fight knives. Now we're talking. Now we're Batmaning. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, ha, ho, ha. This isn't fun with it, everybody. Let's just wait for everybody to come back. And we're back, baby. <clears throat> so, uh... <laughs> I, I'm amazed, Hanson. Your internet went out. Uh, yeah. You texted me, and you were like, yeah, it'll probably be back on in 10 minutes. I was like, wow, you're, you're banking on them <laughs> figuring out your internet that fast. Yeah, it went out this morning, and I was worried about it. It lasted about 10 minutes. Um, and yeah, I know some of you were saying that the plug was pulled because we got a little too close to the truth with these Joker theories. Perhaps it was the Joker that Ooh. killed my internet. Um, let's see, Jeff, I'm, uh, let me tell you what you missed. I figured out what I was doing wrong. I had to throw a batarang, obviously. And then I went in there, and the Joker... <laughs> Wait, were you frantically Googling 
How do I how no. do I pass this thing that I was stuck on? No, I just Blackie. was able to focus for once in my life without having Twitch screaming at me. Uh, um, and so yeah, so then the Joker gassed me, and and then good stuff happened. Um, ah, I don't think we want to drop down. Let's get stuck here instead. This is a radical new location. Uh, so let's try. Okay, genuinely, what's going on here, Jeff? Um, <laughs> we're stuck again. Okay, let's. Ah. Oh. I have a feeling this is going to be a weakness. Looks fragile. Fragile enough for the battering. So you have to scan it first, and then you can aim the battering at it. This is very simple video gaming stuff, Jeff. Nobody should be stuck on this. Wait, now I can go up there? Do I want to go in there? So I'm walking on a 2D plane. Like, it's just an That's awkward so thing to control when everything's at just a weird wonky angle happening here what'd you do in your break i kept doing polls <laughs> we covered all kinds of stuff is uh, that right yep okay okay so this is the, la the last one was people said uh to try blowing on the plug to get your internet to work oh that was their fix okay that's pretty good Not bad. Do you have a, a Joker impersonation, Jeff? <laughs> That's all I got. I don't think you need any more. <laughs> I think that was no. unbelievable. I honestly, I got chills. Bookshelf is built on a hidden rail system and will slide out of the way when a specific book is pulled. All right, Batman. Check out War and Peace. All right, here we go. Um, <laughs> I want to be very clear. This was a this was a joke. I want to be very clear. But I was like walking up to my wife who was at a desk in our living room, and she like she had some text on her phone. She quickly closed it. I was like, "What was that text?" But to be clear, <laughs> it was a joke. I was like, <laughs> and she's like, "I'm embarrassed. I don't want to show you." I'm like, what is it? And she pops up. She was reading War and Peace on her phone. <laughs> Is that several so questions? Wow. Cool guy move, or woman, um, or lame wad move? Because it's cool uh, to read the classics. There's something bizarre yeah. about doing it on a phone, but you're making it work for you with your right busy That's lifestyle. True. So yeah, no one wants to carry around that brick of a book. Right. I guess. Oh, also this factors in for the Twitch poll as well. Um, we have the book, and it was sitting on a bookshelf one room over but she's like i just don't want to lock it around i just i want to actually be able to read it here and there so I, okay. need, you're saying cool guy move yeah we'll say cool guy move okay i don't know if, i don't know if it needs a pull uh, we'll, we'll also say bad husband move to bring up something that your wife was embarrassed about in the first place uh, and then say it, say it to everybody. Maybe that's a secret that I do think it's a cool move that I would bring it up if, because I mean, uh, I think it's that's impressive. Because if I, you thought it was actually embarrassing, I think she's very smart, and I do think it makes her look even smarter. Like with some free yeah. time being a new mom, like I'm gonna read War and Peace. Jesus Christ! <laughs> she just she was good. still at the war part. She hadn't learned about peace. Oh. I didn't want to spoil it for her, but the second half of the book is peace. I do believe. Okay. Time to be a Batman. Again, so does Joker like what con a contract? Goofy run. Yeah. Do you think he contracts out with people to write he he ha 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 ho 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 kill the bat on the walls, or is that's like the real perk of the job? It's like me making YouTube thumbnails. It's like secretly the most fun part. Yeah, I think I think he's he's basically I think Banksy is the Joker, um, and that's that's oh, his primary love. That's interesting. I bet the Banksy freaking loves Joker. Yeah. Banksy more recognizable or the Joker, you think, if I held up a picture? <laughs> <laughs> neck and neck. Okay. Come on. Are you going to let me go get the crate or we have to go find it? This is just a tease of what we could be. Yeah. The Delights Batman Treasure Chest. You ever played a... Other than Arkham, you got any favorite Batman games? Like, do you play the NES one or anything? 
No, really? That's surprising. Oh, I don't think I did. I don't think I've ever played another Batman. I mean, the when the first Arkham game came out, people were like, oh my God, they actually made a good Batman game. Yeah, it had been a long so. go. People like, uh, was it Batman and Robin on Super Nintendo? Is that what that is? Or Batman Animated Series in Super Nintendo? I know Kyle's all about one of those. He's kind of defined his whole life based on one of those freaking things. Yeah. All right, I don't think I want to mess with oh, those He also guys. thought the Flash was more popular than <laughs> Sonic, so. Yeah, that is true. And he said Garfield is more popular than the okay. Joker. It's outrageous. Or maybe those Twitch chat, I forget. They're all the same. Kath, Kath points out Banksy shredded one of his art pieces after it was sold. That is a very Joker that, move. Ooh, that was really cool. We all liked it. Banksy's newer stuff, not so much. Is, is the Banksy guy or girl a little bit like, <laughs> controversy noted, a little bit like Q, where like a lot of people like claim to be them I'll since there's not like point. a centralized person? Like, do we know what Banksy's recent work is? Or is it just a lot of people claiming to be him? I'm beginning to think take right. It's a great question. We kind of know who he is? Kinda. What does that mean? Truefo says I'm Banksy, so there you go. All right. Breaking news. Yeah, there it is. I still can't get over this map in this game. I could really... you just could you just spray spray paint something on like the side of your garage and then be like, Banksy, it's a Banksy. I think you could. Prove me wrong. I think you could. Now I'm gonna sell my garage for ten million dollars. Okay, so it's six nine. No wonder Jeff okay. freaking likes this. Six nine seven. Six nine seven times. Okay, there it is. Batman's favorite. Who made these crypto sequences? Catwoman? Oh my god. Oh, what? You back? Stay put for Did now. I cut out? It's too dangerous. Are you there? there. It it froze for like a split second. Enough time for me to say, oh my god, to myself. Okay, um, good. I was speaking of froze, I think that's what's happening, is it's like negative eight below in Minnesota, so I yeah. assume the internet pipes are all frozen. Now, I know Batman's a cool guy. There's no way this is comfortable <laughs> to no. walk around like this, right? Just slither he's around like Batman. surprisingly fast, though. <laughs> well, he's Batman. Don't mess with him. All right. Uh, do we want to go down there? I guess we don't have an option. Grizzle Gaming Gordon. asks, overall, do you prefer Batman or Spider-Man? What a great question. Now... I think when a character looks as cool as he did when he was walking around, it's tough not to prefer him. But the question is, in what sense? Like, to think about? To play games as? To watch movies of? Who's had better movies? There's a lot of different things. It's a great point. Great point. Um, do you got a gut reaction to that? Um, if we're talking about the character overall, broad, universal... Who you, character who's origin. a more compelling character is that the question sure I let's think... frame it that way um and then i'll say spider-man i think I'm... i really don't i really don't like the whole i'm a billionaire who gets to break oh, the law like that has an age here we well go i'm a billionaire who gets to break the law and go around and beat people up that I don't like. Sorry, everybody. This and YouTube no channel just went me. broke because Jeff and, and, was too ooh, busy look, over here. Oh. Look, I'm so strong because I have all these billion-dollar gadgets. I have a car that drives myself. Yeah, okay, we we don't need any more of those guys uh, in this we world. Thank you very much. Is this a sincere soapbox or is it a half-sarcastic soapbox? <laughs> <laughs> it turns sarcastic. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, yeah, you know, but also... I get that, you know, the world hates rich people more than ever now. And that's that feels right to me. Um, but at the same time, I don't know how I feel about, like, the movies trying to be like, well, we'll just, we'll get around that by referencing it. You know, like, in The Flash, there's a reference where, like, Batman has the lasso of truth around him from Wonder Woman. And he says, like, well, I guess I could probably fix crime if I gave my money away. That'd be a more effective use. You know, that type of thing. I'm like, okay. You can't just read Reddit in your Batman script yeah. and expect it to be cool. So, um, it, I think Batman, I've spent more time thinking about. Like, I really loved 
Batman 1989. That was like one of my favorite movies as a kid. And I love the gameplay, which you just witnessed there. Um, <laughs> I do love when bullets come from off screen. Right. Uh, okay, this time. Just, guys, don't watch me when I go in this vent. It's kind of embarrassing. Thank you. Um, Spider-Man. Overall, I probably like the movies more. Maybe that's controversial to say. Movies? I think yeah, so. Yeah, that's controversial. I mean... Like the new ones? The newest? The Tom Holland ones? or I like... Or Spider-Verse? I like everything but the two Amazing Spider-Man movies. I think, like, okay. the other eight movies are great, I would argue. Um, whereas Batman, Batman 89 rules. Yeah. Batman Returns, I understand freaks like it. I like it. Don't love it. Uh, Batman and Robin... Batman Forever, fun, can't be fine. I don't hate them. Uh, Batman Begins, also fine. Maybe I need to watch it again. Dark Knight Rules, Dark Knight Rises, I like a lot. The Batman, uh, <laughs> Robert Benson, I liked a lot. So you do the math, I don't know. Yeah, it seems like you were trying to make a point and then you <laughs> <laughs> spent two minutes refuting yourself. <laughs> I don't think so, Jeff. Um. I think this is a pretty scientific operation. Oh, okay, so let's go in here. Alright. And Man, I miss the days you could lift a TV, pawn it, and call it a night. I miss not getting kicked in the face. Man, we got problems. Okay, hang on. I gotta do the Can you finish him off, please? Jesus Christ. This is certainly more ambitious than I thought it would be. But it's a weird game where it's being punished by its ambition, I feel like, in some ways, right? Oh, impromptu yeah. video review from Kath. Batman vs. Spider-Man. Jeff, do you want to review that classic game? Batman vs. Spider-Man? <laughs> is that a real thing? Yeah, take what it away. We, what, are, what am I... Okay, yeah. hold on. I'm in the middle of a poll here. Oh, okay. Oh, ho, ho. All right, this time I'm gonna nail this combat. So many guys. Good God, man. man this guy really has the boss. Batman vs. Spider-Man vs. Good God, man. All right, let's head up here. There's a couple different options for where I'm going here. I guess let's just glide kick this fool right in the face, huh? And then, ugh, what did I think was going to happen? What did I think what was going to think happen? Gonna happen? Let's go up uh, Batman versus Spider-Man. Yeah. What can you say? <laughs> um, obviously, we've covered how problematic Batman is. Oh, that uh, was the word. But is, is, but is Spider-Man better? Let's think about that for a right, while. Right. We haven't turned our critical lens on Spider-Man. He delivers pizzas most of the time. His his big his big uh, you know origin story is him failing his uncle. I mean, the one thing that you can say about Batman is his his parents got murdered in front of him. Yeah. That's not really his fault. Not really. Uncle Ben, hello, straight up uh, negligence on Peter's time, part. Peter's part. Peter Peter's parter. Peter <laughs> Parker's part. Packed a part of pickles. Perfect. Um Some hot tea sounds pretty good right about now. Do we need grim dark super serious superheroes in a world that's already kind of grim dark? I say want, nay. I say nay. Do we want the the lighthearted fun friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? That's what it really comes down okay, to. I got this. Who would win in a fight? Is it a is it a fight with your fists or a fight with your heart? Mm. The hearts and minds. Of everyone in their respective communities. That's why I give Batman vs. Spider-Man a ten out of ten because it because you just you just can't stop thinking about it. Right. Um, and it's also the more time we spend thinking about it, the less time we have to think about this combat uh, yeah. scenario. I that we're I know this game trapped did in. not get great reviews, and that was an amazing review. And the number score was a ten out of ten. Okay, I want to take. 70% of the hits for this game and the combat because 
I'm pretty bad at most games, and so I know this game got like sixes and stuff, but I just don't want you to think that this is as trash as I'm making it seem. There's probably some way to make this play okay. I just ain't doing it, you know? Deliberately. Uh, most, most people liked Batman over Spider-Man. But I think it was actually tied, well, wasn't it? Five people voted Batman, three voted Spider-Man, two voted My Little Pony. <laughs> Perverts. So. Little perverts. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, well, that's nice. I mean, maybe if we were playing a... All right, Jesus Spider Christ. Spider-Man game. Yeah. Is the, is the takedown... <laughs> yeah, no, this is this is bad, Hanson. I'm not I'm not blaming you for this. The I fact swear... that... No. The fact that... <laughs> that uh, every time Batman tries to move, it looks like he's wading, like, waist high through the ocean. Yeah. Like, he can't go any faster than that. Nah. No. Yeah. So I guess it leads us to our titular question, Jeff. Um, is it good? Is it is good? Is Batman time for it. Arkham Origins Blackgate good? Time for the right. ultimate vote. And I want to see more than like six votes this time. Right. Dang it. Dang it. These lack of votes. Dang it. By the way, it turns out the answer was just walk up and hit triangle. Um. <laughs> oh, there you go. Well, hey! okay, maybe maybe some of it's you. Yeah, I think that's fair. Okay, all right. Will they know who I am if I'm going through here? Oh, they have no ah, idea. Now who's on the run, huh? Come this I way. Oh, oh, Jesus man. Christ, man. Don't let your friend come around here. Don't you come around here no more. All right. Jesus. See, that's the, that's the part that... That's that just bad. looks universally bad. It yeah. certainly feels universally bad. Uh, but I don't want to color your votes. I don't want to color your votes. Again, if you get right. somebody from Armature in here, I'm sure they could play this game like a freaking champ. I want to like it. It's a, it's a funky, weirder designed Arkham game. You know, like it's uneven, but I think it's cool to have one entry in the series that's just like this blur of different camera perspectives and I think it's I think it's there's something here I mean I'd rather play any Arkham game but but what do I know I you know is this better than Gotham Knights which game would I rather play I don't know that's a question that's a question but I'm sorry we don't have time for that question because we only have time for is this game good nobody got a sense of humor okay now can I just drop behind this fool and then stealth take him down and then free those men. I think that's what's going to happen here. Gosh, this is Everybody radically not 2D. It's <laughs> so good. All right, here we go. Here we go. Just, yep. Yeah, grapple onto that. God damn it. This world is cruel to Batman. Okay. Get your votes in. Is yep. this game good? And you can vote, by the way, on Patreon for another episode of Is This Good? And we'll jump to another game that we need to go back right. and get a new critical consensus on. I'd love to see it. Okay. And there you go. 79%, 19 votes. Say no. No. Black Gate is not good. Wow. Five people said yes. So... Okay, that's Five something. people were wrong. Wow. I mean, it's certainly no Legendary of the Box, but uh, I hope you all enjoyed this look at Batman Arkham Origins Blackgate. Available now on Steam. Run, don't walk. And if you're a big defender of this game, I want to hear from you. Like, this would be a funky, weird thing to play on 3DS. You know, I'm curious if there are people who only had that system that actually really end up liking this game. I'm trying to be really nice did, at the end. Did, yeah, did, did you like that when you crawled into that? And they did the screen transition. The guy was already looking at you, and you couldn't do anything about that. I actually did. Because you couldn't see him before you went through. I actually did think that That's was really fun. good. And now they're all shooting you with assault rifles. I like. think it's kind of fun to get shot with an assault rifle if you're Batman. All right. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching this and supporting your show. Plus, uh, again, we have a new Patreon updates for 2024. If you want to go to patreon.com slash minmax with two N's, you don't have to be a supporter or anything. There's a public post on there talking about some outlining some changes for this year. New people coming in, new people helping out, new shows, all that fun stuff. Or you can uh, jump into the $10 tier over there to help support independent games media directly and vote for more episodes of Is This Good, where we'll check out other games beyond 
Batman Arkham Origins Black Cape. All right, Jeff, thanks for being here, dude. I loved it. Good stuff. All right, love it. Good stuff. Thanks so much, everybody. See you next time. Goodbye. Every week, we let Patreon supporters choose which new show we create with New Show Plus. Should we create another episode of the show you just watched? Check out the biggest new game release? Get into Sea of Thieves? Create an exercise show? It is your call. So thanks to everybody who subscribes on YouTube or supports us over on Patreon. MinMax exists because of you. As always, if you enjoy MinMax content, any help telling a friend is appreciated.